that's right. So, 365 plus 635 equals 1,000. Guys, I am going to tell you what I learned from math. By the way, I just wanted to say sorry to you guys for not posting a lot of videos. It's because I am busy at school and by the way, I have lots of homework to do. Okay! So, um, let's get on to the video. So, um, this is called subtracting to two to six digit numbers with zero difficulty. By the way, um, I think this is very hard. He has the eye of the tiger. He does have the eye of the tiger. Are you sure about that? It's because I only got nine over 11 on this one. So I'm gonna tell you what. By the way, we did this, we did this at school. So um, I'm gonna read this for you guys. So this is what it says. Wait, I'm gonna read. Chris, Christine bought a pair of sh of shoes worth 635 pesos. She gave the cashier a 1,000 bill. How much change did she get? How do we subtract 635 from 1,000? It's we we did this we did this at school and I was wrong. I was wrong with that one. In 1,100 pesos, there are no hundred, tens, and ones. So, we change thousand into nine hundred, nine tens, and ten ones. Wait. So, I think this is like... Oh, uh, Using the expanded form, 1,000 minus 635 so 900 plus 90 plus 10 i don't know a uh, 600 plus 30 plus 5 it uh equals 30 th 300 plus 60 plus 5 so so like 1000 plus uh, 1000 minus 635 equals 600 365 I'm confused I am literally confused so um shortcut methods Christine got a change of 365 pesos here is another example pack this is another example I just want to learn because I get confused of this Every time. So Patrick was able to save 5,255 from his monthly allowance. He wants to buy a cabinet that costs 9,070 pesos. How much more does he need to save so that he can buy the cabinet? Uh, we like this. I got this from our test. Solution. Oh! So he needs 3,815 more to buy the cabinet. Wait, I'm, I am literally confused. Oh my god. Wait. Wait, I am, I am gonna write this so I won't forget. So now, so now I am gonna tell you how it works. So, um, yeah. By the way, I got this on my notebook. It's right over here. So I have one thousand pesos, and and I bought a pair of sandals, which is six hundred, six hundred, six hundred thirty-five. So you might be wondering how. Can you minus the, minus this two? So over here, this for the ones on the zero, this will be ten because it is zero, and this will be nine, nine. So ten minus five 
equals 5. And 9 minus 3, 9, 1, 2, 3 equals 6. So put 6 there. And 9 minus 6 equals 3. So the answer is 635. So 1000 minus 635 is 365. So I am going to tell you another one. So I, so my change is 365. So I'm going to tell you another one. So guys, here's another example. So over here we got 2000. I'm not sure if you can see it. That's 2000 over there minus 655. So, so um like I said, we are going to get this. The zero will be what? It will be number 10. That yeah, will be number 10. The zero, this will be 10. And the other zeros will be 9. Can you see it? Okay. okay. So, so 10 minus 5 equals 5. 9 minus 5. 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, it is 4. And 9 minus 6. 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, it will be 3. And... Uh, you might be wondering what are we going to do with D number 2. So, we are going to cross this out and this will be 1. So, you got to bring it down. So, our change. So, the answer is 1,345. So, let's um, I'm going to show you another example. So, this is our last example. So, let's have, over here, let's have 5,000. Over here, we we'll have 5,000 over here. And minus, minus, let's see, 5,000 minus 345. So over here, over here. So like I said, what like I said, we are going to get this. The zeros will be ten. The other zeros will be nine, and the other zeros will be nine. So nine, nine, and ten. Ten minus five. Ten minus five equals five. Nine minus four. Nine minus four equals five again. And 9 minus 3 equals 6. And this will be 4. And now our ends of 5,000 minus 345 equals 4,655. Great job, you kids! So I hope you get it. And now it's time for the checking by the way checking is plus and i am going to show you how it works so uh checking is basically plus and i am going to show you how it works so <clears throat> so um we answer let's see okay we have one thousand over here one thousand minus six hundred thirty five wait minus six hundred thirty five so, like I said, 10, 9, 9. 10 minus 5 equals 5. 9 minus 3 equals 6. 9 minus 6 equals 3. The answer is, like I said, the answer is 365. Now, we are going to do checking. Basically, it is easy. It's plus. So, um, we are going to get the 365 up here and minus 
D635. So I'm gonna tell you how it works. So over here is our minus plus, whatever. So 100 minus 635 equals 365. Now we are going to take the answer and put it and put it over here and we are going to get the 635 and wait, and put it down put it down <coughs> just like this this is called checking and that will be plus okay that will be plus so 5 plus 5 equals 10 so this is plus over here. So six one plus six equals seven. Seven plus three. Seven in my mind, three in my finger. Seven, eight, nine, ten. So over here will be over here will be one and this will be zero. So one plus three equals four. Six in my mind plus four plus six. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So so the answer is 1,000. I'm going to calculate that if it's true. That's right. So 365 plus 635 equals 1,000. So let's do another one. So let's get 3,000. 3,000. Okay. Minus... 432 we already know what the answer is like that and we're gonna make this 10 9 9 10 9 9 I'm, I'm not sure if you can see it over here okay so 10 minus 2 10 minus 2 equals equals 8 so 9 minus 3 equals 6 9 minus 4 equals 5 so the answer is we forgot about the 3 so the 3 the 3 over here will be 2 so the answer is 2568 over here can you see it? Oh my god. That's the answer. I'm not sure if you can see it too. Here. Okay, that's the answer. So, we are going to do the checking. checking. So, from the minus, we have 2,568 plus 400 Thirty four hundred thirty two. Okay, let's let's plus them. Eight plus two equals eight plus two equals ten. There. Don't mind this. I'm just gonna bura bura it bura bura. And then over here as you can see. So that will be 10, 1 plus 6 equals 7, 7 plus 3 equals 10 again, 7, okay, 1 plus 5 equals 6, so 6 plus 4, 6 and then 9 for my finger, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, so it will be 10 again, so how can you put 10, so we are going to put the 10 over here and over here. It will be zero, zero. 1 plus 2 equals 3. So that will be 3,000. So let's calculate it if it's right or not. So we got 2,568 plus 400, 400, 432. So the answer is, so the answer is right. It's 3,000.
over to here. That's exactly the answer I wanted! And now this is the end of the video because that's all I learned from math. By the way, we are going to do plus next time. So, um, yeah, I hope you liked it and I hope you understand it now. So, I hope you like it. Please subscribe down below. Leave a like and don't forget to ring the notification bell so you can't miss any of my videos. Bye-bye!